Lumberjack. Lumberjack. Time to wake up. Busy day ahead. <sighs> I guess you're right, eh? Time to get cracking. <laughs> manager was waiting for Baxter on the platform. I need you to help Shepard in the marshalling yard. There's a great deal of freight cars there that need to be organized, and I think you'll be perfect for the job. Kicks ass can manage the work in the coal mine alone. I would prefer not to, muttered Baxter. I have better things to do than fool around with freight cars all day. Well, too bad, said the manager. I need you over there. Hey Baxter, said Shepard. Welcome to the marshalling yard. I know you've worked here before, at least I think you have, so I think you know what to do. But if you have any questions, be sure to ask me. I've been here for a while, so I don't need any help from you, said Baxter. You're just a young engine, and I've been around for more than a hundred years. I think I know my way around. You little rascal, scallywag, whippersnapper, whatever you are. Shortly thereafter, the engine set to work pushing and pulling freight cars into place. Baxter even found himself getting into a swing of things and started to enjoy himself. However, working day in and day out in the marshalling yard made him even a little bored himself. He continued to work hard, but his mind was not in the right place. 
and soon began to drift away. He wanted to change, or at least, just wanted to get out of there. It was the end of a busy day, and Baxter was looking forward to a nice rest. Before going home, however, Shepard would always remind him to alert the switch tower to set the points in the proper place before leaving. But Baxter was so distracted, he had forgotten completely. He and his driver grew very impatient, and he began to speed down the track. Unfortunately, as he began to speed up, the points were set against him, and Baxter derailed. Baxter lay dazed and surprised between the rails, and his driver was very furious. Little did they know, however, their problems were only beginning. Bolt was coming in with a good... <laughs> Holy crap! Baxter was brutally rammed in the boiler and derailed completely. He was in a great deal of pain, and there were freight cars lying everywhere. Oh, my bad, man. Sorry about that. <laughs> Whoops. While Baxter laid in despair, he felt that he had learned a valuable lesson. Which was odd, because the old stubborn engine rarely learned anything from an experience. He learned to listen to others, and not take Shepard's warnings for granted, making him a better engine indeed.